Yeah, you know what? Let's just do it. Let's get it. Oh, crap. What the hell? What? Come on! How am I supposed to flip a house that's haunted like this? What's going on, guys? Dre here, and welcome back to House Flipper. Today, we're going to get back out and celebrate Halloween in style because I heard we have a new house in House Flipper and it's a haunted house. Now, as you can see, uh, I should mention that we I had to reset my save, so unfortunately we do not have my fancy office anymore. We're back to the crappy office. But I did indeed embezzle some money, and as you can see, we got 433k over there, aka I just played with the game of files and uh, gave me some money because we've already seen how House Flipper works. I want to check out this new house though, and it is not a cheap one. If we go down to the bottom here, uh, I think, where is it here? There we go. So Marta Myers House is the new house. And being that her last name is Myers, I think she might be related to someone who is very, very popular. Goes by the name of Michael. So yeah, here we go. A beautiful big house in the back country for sale. A lucky strike for those people who value silence, peace, and want to take a rest from the city noise and other people's company. Just think, only you, your house, and the nature around you. The place was abandoned many years ago, and it needs a complete overhaul. But in the right caring hands, it will become a true gem. We advise superstitious people do not buy it. Okay, well, obviously something happened here, so we're gonna buy this house. And by the way, sorry this is a day late. I forgot that Halloween was yesterday. That sounds pretty damn bad, but uh, yeah, we're gonna be celebrating Halloween on the 1st. Let's do it. So hard to let go. If you don't want to put up a house for sale, maybe you'd rather move there. Uh, no, I'm, I'm definitely not gonna move here. Oh my god, there's a freaking gnome on the porch. Alright, well, obviously, as you can see by the aura... Uh, hey, Michael! So yes, Michael clearly hasn't left this house. Is he actually gonna, like, haunt me or something? God, this is like creepy music and everything. Oh, can we actually get rid of bushes now? I'm not really sure. It's been a while since I last played, but it looks like they're actually starting to get into gardening. What is that over there? Uh, okay, it's just a rock. I'm freaking out, clearly. All we have so far is a garden- wait. He was looking right at me- wait, whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. Okay, so if I look away- is he? Now he's looking straight. That is a possessed garden gnome. I figured out the, what, what's going on with the house. Clearly we have a garden gnome problem. I'm actually scared, guys. I don't want- oh, is he getting closer? No, he's not getting closer. Okay. Alright, let's do this, guys. We have to renovate this house and somehow sell it. Michael Myers' old house. Oh my god. The, ah! Oh! No, I don't- I don't like this. Haunted houses creep me out, guys. I think most people are creeped out by haunted houses. What the hell is this, though? Serious? Did you eat somebody? Okay. Well, here. Oh God damn it! It it, it does look at me. I don't like it. Um. You know what? I kind of want to. Can I actually pick him up? Oh my God! I can pick him up. Okay. You know what? We're gonna put you. Uh. Where? Where? I don't even know if I should keep this guy in here. We'll just put him right over here for right now. Uh. But yeah. I guess we're going to try and upgrade this house. Should we explore it first? I'm actually really scared. I don't really want to go to- Oh, God. Damn it. Damn it! I hate it! See, I don't know if there's actually ghosts in here or whatnot, so... In fact, this this thing could be possessed as well. It's a creepy little bunny. So we're gonna keep all the creepy things in the living room. I guess they invited- Ugh, Do I want to go to the basement first? Yeah, you know what? Let's just do it. Let's get it- Oh, crap. What the hell? What? Come on! How am I supposed to flip a house that's haunted like this? All right, well, let's just get started by cleaning up around here, shall we? This place seems a little bit safer than the rest, so, uh, yeah, we're going to, uh, just clean this up. There we go. Everything's fine. Sh should I just sell it like this? I don't really feel comfortable going down. Oh, god damn you, you gnome. I really should. What is this? I probably should just get rid of the gnome. How, how much does the gnome cost? $28. You know what? I'm gonna keep you, Gnome. You might act- Oh, I didn't even notice a scream mask here. You might actually be on my team. Are these just boarded up? Yeah, these are just boarded up. Okay, so there we go. We got another room over here. I wish this music would stop playing. Uh, so how am I supposed to go down to the basement? Because when I went to the stairs, I think I was dying? Let's try that again. Yeah, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay. Uh... I think that will seriously kill- You know what? Let's just wait for the basement. Let's go upstairs. Let's check out this first, too. Uh, nothing creepy in here, so that's good. Alright, so it says store is not available yet. Like I said, like I told you, I played with the, uh, files here, so we technically have a new character. 
but uh, if we go to the store, it looks like we're actually okay. Mountable toilet standard. Let's see if we can buy it, and indeed, yes, we can. Okay, so we're totally fine. Let's assemble this thing before Michael Myers comes and kills me. I am going to try and sell this house for a profit. I don't know who the hell's gonna buy it. Maybe Michael himself. He might be the guy I need. We got a few people interested. I want one bathroom, not two. Well, I'm sorry I gave you an extra bathroom, you little jerk. Uh, we'll start working on this later. Uh, at least I know we can now use the store, so that's good. This is closed now. I want to keep this open, because where the hell... Okay, he's still over there. Is he holding a knife? What's up, Michael? Yeah, he is clearly holding a knife. Who would live here? Seriously, there's, there's, there's not even a road attached to this. Okay, thanks for opening the, the door, Ghost. I appreciate it. Let's go upstairs. Oh, wow. I, did I just turn blue? Uh, okay, so there's the other bathroom that the guy was complaining about. What do we got? Is that... Is it, that's definitely feet. Oh, and great, we got cockroaches over here, too. So, oh my god, you're alive! You're alive! Hello? What? The... Okay, well, at least I don't have to clean up the lady. I don't know how you would clean up a lady. Uh, was that in my mind? Is she still here? Oh my god, I have so many questions right now. This is this is seriously creepy. They, they did a really good job at turning House Flipper into a creepy place. So it looks like... I, uh, no, no, not the bunny in the closet. Uh, I, I think I pretty much explored everything, so at least now we won't get creeped out. Where did that lady go? Did she... Okay, the, the window's closed. I... That, that, that was creepy. Jesus Christ. I don't know if you heard that, but freaking Google just scared the hell out of me behind me. Thanks, Google. I really appreciate that. You know what? We didn't actually look outside either, so... It doesn't look like much is going on down here. Well, there's definitely been some foot traffic back here. You can see there's a little walkway going... Wait, what's that? Oh, God! Damn it! Seriously? You lo you left one that's above ground? I actually had what pick up? What do you want me to do with this? Uh oh my god. So you really want me to bury this? I I mean, shouldn't we go call the cops or something? I think I'm going to be accused for murder now. Let's go downstairs. It's the one place we haven't been to. So oh my god. Okay. Yep. I am Oh! What the hell was that? Something just growled at me. Uh, is there anything better that I have to defend myself? Okay, but seriously, this is, uh... Wh whoa. Did I... Wait! Where'd the door go? Oh, God. Okay, do, do I want to open... What the hell? Wait, am I crazy? Oh, my God! This thing is crazy! Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna go through over here, because I'm gonna be attacked when I go through that door, so... Let's just, uh, make my own way in. Hello? Anybody in there? Okay, there's actually no- something growled at me. I know that. But, uh, yeah, we have a possessed door here, too. Let me get in here. Oh, there's a light switch. That's what I need. That didn't do anything. Oh my- what the hell? Are you eating a baby? Yep. Okay, we clearly- where'd this door go? Oh my god, I am so confused. Okay, so- Clearly, this thing is absolutely- Oh, there goes the door again. Yeah, that- that door, I think we're gonna have to get rid of that. That's creepy. Alright, so we explored the house. I think I'm gonna bury this thing. Uh, I just wanted to see if there was anything downstairs that we could, uh, do. Hole is completely dug. Now you can plant- did it say I could plant the coffin? This isn't a freaking tree, dude. Alright, insert the coffin. There we go. And- really, I have to put soil around it? Oh my god, that is so creepy. Okay. Whoa. Uh, hey, I think I did it. Did I get rid of the curse? Wait, 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 wait. Is it all nice in here? If, if, I, if I go down to the basement, is there still creepy stuff? Okay, there's still creepy stuff, but it's just a picture. What? I wonder if there's something behind this. Nope, nope. Okay, so there might be more secrets here. This is, I don't like that these things are still here, but I kind of like them too. They're really hardcore. So yeah, I think doing that got rid of the curse or whatever. Is is Michael still here? No. We have birds chirping, ladies and gentlemen. Birds chirping. So I think that's all I needed to do. And it looks like there's actually... Is there a house over there? No. We're still kind of in the middle of nowhere. But at least now, it feels much more presentable. 
All right, well, back to house flipping, I guess. That was uh, an interesting experience, to say the least. Can I not break this wall? Why can't I break the walls now? All right, it's not going to let me... I was able to break this one. Well, that one is breakable, so for some reason, this wall here, it just won't go away. Well, that's going to look absolutely stupid, but okay. Uh, we're going to have to have a wall there, I guess. You know what? We might be able to make kind of like a basement bedroom down here or something. Not that I'd recommend sleeping down here, but hey, it's not my house. I'm just here for a profit, damn it, and that's what we're going to get. Now, the house is actually not too bad. We obviously need to get rid of the cobwebs and everything, but it's not awful. I've seen way worse in this game. So at least we got that going for us. We just need to upgrade it a little bit, maybe paint the walls, not tell people that it's crazily haunted and there's a dead person in the backyard that I buried. You know what? All for a profit, man. All for a profit. Actually, you know what? Let's get rid of the evidence here. Uh, can we actually sell this? Oh, there, there, there's so many things wrong about this. Yeah, we're just gonna sell the gravestone. That's an extra hundred bucks in the bank. Oh my god, you can actually see a little piece of wood from the actual coffin. Can I... I don't think I can use that spade, so... I wonder what happens if I hit it. Hello? You still in there? Doesn't seem like it wants to come out. All right, so let's actually get to it. We're gonna have to obviously do something here. Uh, we have some holes in the backyard. Uh, but yeah, I'm just gonna quickly clean up and then we'll get to actually decorating the house. But we got a lot of cobwebs and stuff to deal with. Okay, not sure where the creepy lady went, but uh, you know what? Maybe she's the cockroach queen. You know, we're, we're gonna vacuum these suckers up. <laughs> There we go. Enough cockroaches are eliminated. You've destroyed the cockroach nest. Well, we're gonna definitely going to get rid of all of them, though. There we go. Oh, there's still a few little guys there. Pull out the vacuum cleaner. We definitely don't want them to spread. Let's, uh... I'm pretty sure they're totally gone. Can't seem to suck up a lot of these guys. Come on, there we go. And there we go. I destroyed the cockroach nest. Cockroach nest. So another task done. Creepy lady that was over here. Not sure where she is. Uh, they're just going to have to find out for themselves. Because I am not touching that. I don't even know how I would clean up a creepy lady. Okay, house is spick and span. It's actually, I don't think we, I missed any pieces of dirt. So as you can see, looking a lot better now. A little bare. I got rid of some of the crappy doors. I'm going to keep the front door. It's not awful. Uh, at least it's not that creepy. So we're, we are good to go. Now it's time to, I guess we'll start with doing repairs. We got a lot of red zones here. So I got to quickly do this. And then we get to the decorating part. So... Usually, there's a lot of rads involved with doing this, and, uh, did they change these at all? Uh, they might have updated them a bit, but it looks like it's very similar to what it used to be. It's been a while since we last played, I gotta remember that. Uh, such an awesome game, though. So there we go, that's done. Now we just need a shower. You know what, we're just gonna do that instead. For some reason, that other shower wasn't working, so I just installed a whole new shower with mountable system. I think that's how we gotta do it anyways, so... Now, can we install... I thought I was going to install the shower, too. Clearly, that's not working. Uh, bye now. And yes, there we go. Okay, so there was something wrong with the other one. Uh, well, that's no big deal. We got it done, at least. Let's get these things all assembled. I don't remember it being sideways like this before. There we go. Okay, may may maybe it was like that. This is crazy, man. We actually have to install every little piece, and... I love the attention to detail. They've been doing a really good job updating this game. What do you want me to do here? Okay, plug in that. Um, I don't even know what I'm looking at, game. Can, can you, can you help me here? Uh, 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 oh god. Okay, go in there. <laughs> I, I actually sprung a leak. That was so cool. Oh god, we got water pouring out of these too. Okay, clearly I think I should have turned off the water. That would have been smart. But hey, smart is not my middle name. Yeah, there's definitely more detail to this now. I don't know if I like these angles. It's kind of confusing. I remember doing a lot of this before, but definitely not as much as I'm doing now. Like, you have to literally assemble everything from the little sliders for the doors to everything else. I think it's still leaking as well. That could be a problem. Uh, what am I doing now? I have no idea. Okay, I'm just going to click everything that it tells me to click. And that's how to install a shower, guys. I think we're almost done. Look at that. It's so easy, man. This has got to be the last one, right? Oh, no, we still got to... What are we doing now? Oh, the sliding underneath piece. There we go. Okay, so now we just got to clean it up a little bit. My bad. Didn't mean to do that. There we go. A nice new shower, though. Look at that. Oh, God, not again. I didn't mean to do it. I didn't mean... What, what am I doing? Oh, God. Okay, come on. Uh, uh, okay, we, we got a little bit of a problem here. I'm trying to figure out what you want me to do. What am I missing? 
These are all screwed in. Oh, you want me to do that first? Okay, we're just squirting water everywhere. I don't think it really matters. This is Michael Myers' house, so uh, I don't think really people care if there's going to be a little bit of water <laughs> on the ground. What now? Oh my god. So yeah, they definitely added a lot more things to do uh, with everything that you need to install. I'm seriously, okay, I had to click that first, then I had to click that. Now I screw that in. If I actually built things, I might know what I'm doing, but I have no idea. Okay, but I did need a new sink. It was pretty ugly, so there we go. Very basic bathroom, nothing too pretty. We might have to retile this later, too. We'll, we'll deal with the walls later, though. I want to install all the fixtures. First floor is done. Got a little bit more to do up here, obviously. Okay, did a quick search. I think I repaired all of the appliances and uh, upgraded a few of them as well. So now on to the fun part. We actually get to start designing. I guess we'll start uh, from the basement. Uh, what I think I'm going to do down here, because I don't want anyone who buys this house to live down here. We're going to make a, a, like a renter's basement so you can rent this place out if you want to. Uh, creepy artwork and all. So... Uh, I really wish I could get rid of this wall. Let me try again. Yeah, it's just like... It doesn't want to get rid of any of this wall, as you can see. So I got to build around this thing. And this wall, too. Yeah, this one's not going to get rid of as well. So what we're going to have to do... Unless I put a door in here. You know what? That would actually be a good spot for a door. So we will put a door in there. And let's start off with that. So front door, internal door, door, Wuru Brown. Ah, uh, front door knocker dark. You know what? Let's just do an in generic internal door. Oh, I can buy many? I'm gonna buy now. Uh, I didn't realize I could buy many, though. Can I not put this in here? Okay, I can. Thank God. All right, so now we just put a wall in, and there we go. It's not creepy anymore, guys. Look at that. Okay, and there we go. Once that's painted, it should look great. Now, I guess we can make this a bathroom, and then we'll have kind of an open area for a kitchen slash dining room slash living room combo. And look at that. Okay, so now we got kind of a living space down here for a renter. <laughs> I love just opening up that door to the living room, or sorry, the bedroom, and seeing this monster guy eating a baby. Like, who even drew this artwork? This is this is so gross. All right, let, let's use the uh, old forest mist here. Okay, so, oh, that's the buy many. Okay, I don't think I'm going to need more than a couple in this. Oh, wait, what did I do wrong here? Wait, what? Why is it so thick? Ah, oh, god damn it. Okay, so I guess the only thing we can do is just build this out and have a little bit of a space inside for the doorway. I guess we can move the doorway closer to the middle as well. God, that looks so weird. All right, we're just gonna keep it like that. That's totally fine. Doesn't have to be perfect. This is this is a flipper house, not, you know, my home. So there we go. Now we have the upgraded painter, so we should be able to just go crazy here. And look at this. Oh, I love it. All right, and there we go. Let me just make sure. Oh, yeah, there's no windows here because it's a basement apartment. We're going to sell those. I mean, it's not pretty, but hey, it's better than nothing. You know what? We should probably put something on the floor here. Well, we do have some hardwood here. You know what? Let's let, let's do some hardwood. We're going to buy many. Um, is this really just... Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, that's right. You can do it this way. I love it. Look how easy it is. This is this is why you need hardwood, guys. It's this easy to install. I'm kidding. Hardwood's extremely difficult. Do not buy it. If, if you do not want to uh, install it, because it is not easy, except in House Flipper, it... Whoa. Well, that's not creepy. Uh, my painting... Does this painting still... What the hell? Wait. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, okay. That confused me. I think we should be good now. Yes, as you can see, the uh, baby eating guy is back, so we're okay. All right, and I bought some recessed lighting because I love the look of recessed lighting, and look at that. It actually looks... <laughs> Aside from the painting, it looks nice in here. I don't think I did that perfectly, but hey, it's recessed lighting. It doesn't matter. Oh, really? Really? I can't paint the creepy stairs? Oh, that's just going to be an eyesore now, isn't it? Can I paint this? That makes no sense. Why can't I paint the damn side of the stairs? It's not letting me, seriously. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna have creepy stairs, and we're just gonna have to paint the rest of this place. <laughs> All right, so what I'm doing is, uh, I, I couldn't stand this. I mean, it looks pretty cool in here. It's a little dark right now. I need to work on the lighting. But what I'm go doing right now is just hiding this old wall with a new wall. We still have lots of paint anyway, so I figured I'd just do it this way. 
Because I really do want this house to look nice, man. It is Michael Myers' house after all. Or whoever some Marta Myers is. I'm assuming it was his wife or something creepy like that. But yeah, now we uh, got rid of the old wall, hit it back be behind this wall, and what I can do actually is put a door here, like a front door, so it's like a legit apartment, and I think that should look really good, so let's do that. Alright, and after spending way too much time, I have uh, myself a little rental apartment here. Now, it's not the prettiest, I... Uh Put a huge kitchen in here for some reason with a really small fridge. Uh, honestly, it's because this is quicker than installing a sink and a stove at the same time. But I think it came out alright. I got random pictures everywhere. For some reason, two pictures of sunflowers because I, I guess I really like sunflowers. But we also got a computer desk in here. Uh, yeah, a good rental apartment here. Now the bathroom. Yep. <laughs> That's the bathroom. Couldn't install a bathtub, so I figured, you know what, let's just add a pooper and a mirror. We're good to go. Okay, so there we go. The basement apartment is indeed done. We have everything completed. Let's get back up and actually do the house that we're living in. Should I make it as nice as down there? I, I kind of like the idea of having that as the nice part of the house. You know, the thing we're renting. Oh, God. Uh, well, there's a problem. We can kind of uh, spy on our neighbors here. Okay, first thing I want to do, let's put some sliding doors in here, man. This is uh, a perfect spot for them, and there we go. So now there's not a creepy hole in the wall. I think I'm going to keep this mask. Oh, wait, was its tongue always out? This thing is... Hold on. Oh, it does change. Okay, I'm not crazy. It, it changes every time you look at it. I like that. I'm glad that thing stayed. That thing's not even that scary. It's kind of cool. All right, so we're going to do very minimal amounts of improvements here. Where is this the kitchen? I just realized I don't have a kitchen. What the? Who sells a house without a freaking kitchen? Uh, hold on. We gotta fix that door. It's gonna bother me forever if I don't. There we go. That looks better. Is there seriously not a kitchen in this house? Do I have to build a kitchen? Yeah, I don't... How the hell do you live without a kitchen? I mean, I guess this could be a kitchen. That'd be really weird having a kitchen on the second floor, though. So... I guess I could... I could definitely make a kitchen over here. So I guess we're gonna have to do that. We're gonna have to do a kitchen... Uh, living room combo. Now I'm gonna move this over just a little bit. I like this. We're gonna keep that nice and cozy. We can put a TV here once again. Uh, let's get into that right now. I'm gonna do another hanging TV because it was rather big and I like it by now. Really? Okay, so what we're gonna have to do is, uh, well, I guess we could put the TV in the middle here. We're gonna have to flip this and put this by the stairs because for some reason I can't hang anything on the stairs. That's fine. We still got a TV. We have a nice little living room here. We have to make a really small kitchen, though. All right, gonna get rid of this ugly lamp. So there we go. We have our TV with our DVD player. It's, it's you know, the early 2000s once again, guys. We got DVD players again. Am I not gonna be able to paint this? I just thought about that. I might not be able to paint the uh, stairs, so we might want to make this room gray just to kind of combine it with that. All right, but we'll worry about that later. Let's get a kitchen set up here. Now, kitchens, uh, they can be really difficult or really easy, depending on how I want to do it. I really like the look of this, and we have some darker wood in here, so if we, ooh, yeah, make it something like that. The ornaments, the top thing, we're going to make that white. Let's try this. We're going to buy now. Oh, it's actually not as big as I thought. All right, sick. We can just put this here. We'll obviously flip it around so it's in the right direction, but look at that. It doesn't make sense, though, <laughs> because that ornament, the top design, should be at the roof. So, it's, 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 it looks so weird. Okay, you know what? I opted for this instead. I couldn't find the same wood, unfortunately. So, uh, please ignore the ugliness of this. It definitely is ugly, but uh, it will look better. Trust me. At least now, the roof's where the roof should be, and we have everything we need in here. So... It's coming together. There's a few things I would have liked to improve. I should probably just use the kitchen, the same kitchen I have downstairs, but uh, I want it to be a little bit different up here too. So yeah, we're gonna keep it like this. Not the prettiest kitchen, but hey, it will do. And it seriously is amazing what a little paint can do. Check it out now. It doesn't look so bad now, does it? Uh, still not totally happy with the kitchen. I like that it knows that this is a living room with a kitchenette, by the way. You can see it at the top right. Uh, but yeah, this floor is pretty much done. You know what? This doesn't look bad either with it just being white. I'm actually okay with that. Uh, yeah, I think I'm done here though. So let's go upstairs. We'll sell the rest of these. I clearly buy way too much paint, but hey, that's fine. You can sell it for a profit anyways. Oh yeah, there's a bathroom here. Uh, 
Yeah, you know what? It's a little ugly. We should at least retile this. And there we go. We got some clean walls at least. Man, that tile's a little bit aggressive. Not sure if I like it totally, but uh, we already put it on, so done with that. See you later, bathroom. By the way, there's one mirror you can choose in this game, and it's a huge mirror. We need more bathroom mirrors, because it kind of looks dumb when you have a bathroom without mirrors. Okay, another bathroom here. Um, This one actually... I really wish I could clean these. I've tried to clean them. You can't actually, like, buff out the stuff that's on them, so I actually really like this tile, though. I think I'm gonna keep this the same way. It's not that bad, and, uh, yeah, I'm happy with that. Is there... Oh, man, I missed a cobweb. Look at that. And bam, done once again. Now, I guess the only place we could really kind of stylize this, obviously we could put some artwork on the wall, but maybe even put a nice plant at the end of the hallway here or something, uh, just because there's not much going on there. So we haven't done any jucca yet. Uh, oh, you can actually change the pot color. All right, let's match it with the walls. Pretty aggressive blue there, but hey, it will work. And you know, I'm gonna do two plants because there's a lot of room in here. So we got another large plant here, this guy buy that, and you know what? Maybe we should even do a table in here or something. I have no idea. I'm just trying to fill space at this point. Ah, there we go. That's kind of nice, and we'll put, uh, you know what? There's some... If we go into decorations here, pictures and paintings, there's some hanger paintings, or like, uh, table paintings, I guess you could say. Frame photo of a woman, as in the woman who's in this house still. Let's, let's buy her. Looks like it's an awful picture, man. It's... God damn, it's even composed badly. That's great. We're gonna put that there. And there we go. We have like a little woman shrine here. <laughs> this is so weird. Okay, now on to the creepiest room of them all. The one that had the woman in it. Um, I actually really like this orange. I, I might keep it orange. Just obviously repaint it because it's pretty damn messy in here. So let's see, where did you find that orange? You know what, actually wall panels might be fun too. We'll do it in a different room because I want to keep this one orange. We're gonna go Mandarin orange, buy now. I, th I think this is the exact same orange, so we just kind of have to touch up the walls. Could be wrong though. Yeah, you know what, buy plaster and plaster to cavity. Oh, that's, okay, so we just need plaster. Okay, so you know what? I don't think we even need to paint this thing. We're just gonna need, we're gonna need to buy some plaster. So let's go. That should be also in walls. And there we go. We got some plaster. It's been a while since I did this. By now, I have no idea how many I need to do, but we're going to switch to plastering and plaster up those suckers. Okay, so we will have to repaint the wall. So it's a good thing I bought that paint. But uh, yeah, get rid of those holes, man. Get rid of all those holes. Is it done? It's hard to tell. You can now put plaster the plaster hole in the wall. Oh, okay, so there we go. Is that good? I think if it's gray, it's not done yet. As you can see, it turns white when it's totally done. All right, I think that's good. Back to painting. And is this a different color? No, this is the exact same color. So we're just going to paint over those plasters. And that's it for this room, pretty much. All right, look at that, like new. You know what, let's put some wall decorations on just because we can. You know what, we'll also put a plant here. Do I have room for a plant? I can put it on the bedside table. Look at that, that's a big ass plant, man. Yeah, not much choice for l large paintings here. You know what? I'm going to go back to the, the handy-dandy sunflowers just because it will match this room quite well. And there we go. Added a little bit of flair to this. Please ignore any possessed girls that are in there. There we go. One room is less creepy now. Now into the final room. I think we need plaster for this room. I could be wrong, though. Let's buy paint first just to see. Uh, what do we want to do with this room? What haven't we done in terms of colors? Oh, that's right. I want to do wall panels. Let's do wall panels in this room. I kind of like this one. We're going to buy many of these. Wall panels do take a little bit longer, but I think it's going to be worth it. And then I don't even think we need to plaster anyways. So tiling and paneling. Um, there we go. Okay, so yeah, I literally just slap it on there. Grab it and slap it. Look at that. It's as easy as that to put panels on, guys. <laughs> All right, tiling's done. Let's get a sin single minimal in here. Uh, no, we're going to keep the legs like that. And buy now, because we really don't have room for anything better than this. And you know what? It fits perfectly. I like I like it. It's fitting with the color, too. Uh, a little dark in here. I still have to deal with the lamps as well. I don't know really what I want to do, though. Should I just go for desk lamps? Because I hate the roof lamps that this game has. Ceiling lamp cube looks pretty cool, but I don't want it to droop down too much. All right. Does that give enough light? Yeah, that's, that's kind of cool. I like that. We'll accept that. Uh, let's go back to furniture here and tables, tables, tables. Is there a way to go to desk or sorry, bedside tables? Doesn't look like it, so we're gonna have to do 
Do we not have bedside tables? We can definitely use some of these as a uh, bedside. Oh, there's actually one right here. Perfect. Okay, so we're going to match that kind of with the wood here. There we go. And we'll do a nice bedside table over here. I should have did two of them, maybe. You know what? Actually, this is a single bed. We only need one. And let's put a lamp on that. I don't know if we can turn that on or not. But we'll do that with... Oh, yeah. Yellow. Nice. Keep it yellow in here. It does look good. And there we go. Okay, so very basic room. Not much room for anything else. I guess we can put a... Oh, man, I don't want to be in here. This is a creepy place. But I guess we can put a wardrobe in here. Let's keep with the kind of yellowness here. We're going to not touch the bunny. He's just going to live there. And there we go. We have a nice little walk-in closet. That room's done. Moving on back to this room. It's getting dark out again, and it's kind of creeping me. What's light outside? You know what? I'll find out later. But uh, we just got to finish up this one. Now, this one doesn't have a closet, so it's, it looks like a, it's a little bigger, though. All right, and there we go. So we got our cupboards. We also have a, sta a desk lamp, so I don't even know if I'm going to put lighting in here. I think this will be good just like this. Very basic room, but uh, it looks like a, as a room should. So, yeah, I think I'm pretty happy with that. We did everything that I wanted. We updated a lot of the stuff that I didn't like. And, oh yeah, we didn't put lighting down here, so let's just finish up with that. I think I'm going to use recessed lighting again. It's just what I like to use. Okay, even trying to get these as straight as possible, it, like, goes randomly sideways, as you can see. So, not really sure how good that's going to be, but it will be good enough. These don't have to be perfect anyways. As long as it gives us light, that's the important part. So, is there a... Yep, there should be right here. Bam. And there we go. I like it. It's kind of got, like, romantic lighting. You know what? We should probably put a couple more going up to the top floor. So, there we go. Look at that. That's not creepy at all. God damn that mask. Now, is there anything that we missed? It is nighttime once again. Did this come back? No. Doesn't look like anything happened. So I think we got rid of the spookiness. And now we can actually sell this place. And I think we'll get a lot of money for it. It actually looks nice now. Let's quickly do a, a run through here just to show you what we did. Oh, crap. All right, I forgot about this room. Let me quickly do this room too. I, lo I love the size of this monitor, by the way. This is not a TV. This is an actual computer monitor. Uh, but yeah, finished up this room. Well, I'm finishing it up now. Uh, we need a keyboard. There we go. And being that this is an office, I wanted to actually put a computer down here. Is there actually computers in this? I don't think I put a computer downstairs. I mean, there's a loudspeaker that kind of looks like a computer. I don't think they have... Oh, wait. Never mind. I lied. There it is right there. So we got a new little computer down here. Of course, every office needs a computer. There we go. And it, did that make anybody happy? I really haven't been trying to make the people happy, by the way. So hopefully they're happy with this. I mean, I'm happy with this, and that's the important part. Anyways, back to our wonderful house here. Let's go downstairs. Uh, ignore that. We're just going to pretend that's not there. And, whoa. Looked like there was like a green fog there. But I, I actually like the downstairs more than the upstairs. Uh, it just looks well put together. Now... This room's gonna be always creepy. That's kind of the point of this one. We have the blood red poop room. And over here, we have our wonderful bedroom. So yeah, love the recessed lighting down here. It actually does work kind of well. I mean, the kitchen's a little big, but aside from that, I'm really happy with it. And of course, going upstairs, I really like this green that I chose. Did I do this? Okay, yes, I did tile this. That's right, so that's totally good. Just want to make sure I'm doing everything. We got this bathroom, which I didn't touch at all, so that's the one room I did not touch. Oh, I didn't put a light in this room either. Okay, so let's do that as well. We may as well, you know, do this right. What I'm actually going to do in here is just do, a, just do a nice floor lamp, you know? We'll do actually two of them, maybe. We'll do one over there, and then go back to the lamps. I wish it came back to where I was, but we have another lamp we can do right over here and then we can just manually turn these on so there we go i like it it's got a yellow glow too kind of matches the room it's almost like there wasn't a creepy girl in this room a little while ago all right and over here i just want to make sure did i do all the lighting yes i did i have one little lighting in here and finally in the final room yeah we got a lot of lighting in here as well so yeah i think that's a good flip on this house well we won't know if it's a good flip or not until we sell it so yeah, goodbye, Michael Myers house, or should I say some Marta Myers, whoever you are. Let's sell this thing, and uh, hopefully no demons go your way if you buy this, but hey, it's your problem now. I just fixed it up for you. That's what I'm here for. 357 How much should I spend it, by the way? I bought it for 235 
Um, is that how, how much I bought it? Is that including upgrades? God damn. These guys really want this house. And it took me two hours for the record to upgrade that house. That is real time, by the way. It did take two hours to do that, which, I mean, is a little bit of time. Four bedroom, well, well. Now four people move in. There we go, 382. I'm going to get 100,000 profit. Well, actually, even more, because I could probably try and push these guys up. 415,000? $168,000 profit. Now, if we negotiate this right, too, we might be able to get an extra few grand here. I'm going to throw 30 out and see what they say. The Johnson family, this is the perfect big house. So here we go. Holy crap! Just like that, we got an extra 30 grand, so I'm gonna hit okay with that. Look at that, a $200,000 profit on a house that was $200,000. That's pretty damn good. Even if it's Michael Myers' house, I'm happy with that flip. We're gonna accept that offer and call it a good day of house flipping, man. <laughs> and back to my shack we go with a lot of money in our pockets. Yeah, that felt really good. So yeah, we're gonna wrap up this one here, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed checking out the Halloween update for House Flipper. Obviously, I'll be keeping an eye on this game as it is being developed. There's supposed to be some garden DLC coming out soon. I think I saw it inside here. Ah, there we go. The garden DLC available soon. So I've always said... They need to add gardening to this game, and that's probably when we'll check out this game again, when we can actually work on the outside as well. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks so much for watching and liking, guys. And I'll see you in the next one.